doing a mod with it. He is doing a mod with you. Do you like it? You knew it's coming as soon as you saw it in the barn. Come on. You didn't think he was going to do a mod thing on this. You know? You should have known when you saw it in that barn that he was going to do a mod with you on something he loves very dear. You would come. So there we have it. A bobcat. And not only a bobcat. A bobcat that you can actually use, you know? Amazing, isn't it? So let's just get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Let's have some fun. Now, what can you do with a bullcat? You know, it's a bit of a skill, really, isn't it? Bullcat moving. You know, because of course they're one of the most jerkiest things out there. You know? You know, it's only time because the fidgets are going to this is going to fall. And there it goes. But is that the bobcat's fault? The physics don't weigh nothing. Of course not. You know, it really ain't. But as far as moving two barrels, it can be done. You know? No, I don't like putting this sort of equipment, you know, to mod with you into work. You know? The thing you've got to remember, this bobcat is nothing like you've seen before. I mean, I've played the other bobcat. And this, is nothing like it. Well, this you can actually use on a day to day basis. You know? I mean, it's so accurate. I could probably balance a pound coin on the end of the tour and it's still do its job. Marvellous now. You can see it can be done, but you can also see that if things go wrong, you can be sorted pretty fairly. You know? You know, if you go stupid with a bull cat, then it's going to chuck you a little fishy rod, you know? You use it nicely, gently on the controls. 
You can actually operate this in some sort of manner. Okay. Now I'm at the moment in my let's play series. And I'm doing a bit behind the scenes, but I thought you know, instead of showing you stuff that you can't do, I'll show you stuff that you can do. And you can sort this out pretty quickly. Sorry if I'm not going talky talky. You know, it's a little bit of complication going on here. The problem here is I picked up one too higher than the other. The easiest way to do it is to let go one. Go down together, and then they should both go down. Pretty much, how you expect them to do in real life. Now you know the frigates of this game are a bit poverty, so you have to allow for that. That's not the modders fault. That's giants, and it's as simple as that. But saying that, this is a lot better. And it was in 15. So on that, yeah, they've actually making it better. That means that one day they'll actually get there. With a lot more time and probably a lot more money. They get there. You know? Now you can see what's in the background. And as you can see, you can actually operate this machine. Now people say, oh, don't use spikes. Well, I'll let you do a little secret. You're keeping them in a barn for yourself. There's no reason why you can't use spikes. Because trust me, by the time you get them, they're not as perfectly wrapped as this. You know, the amount of times you have to re wrap silage in real life is horrendous. You know? You wouldn't believe it. You know. There you go. These are going to be used within a short period of time. I've got no problem using spikes on my farm with these. In fact, you can get patches that go over if you really want to be fussy. You know. I've even known people to use forklift pallet tines. You know, I'm talking about farmers, they don't go out and buy special stuff every time they new comes along.
as you can see, it pretty much works how well, you expect it to. Now the other question, is it too big? Well, I don't think it is. It's weird because you're going through barns and that, that makes it look taller sometimes, but... You know? Not the best part, no. There we go. I'm sorry if there's not a lot of talking. The best way to do a mod with you is put it out there. Before those people think, oh, you got the water stripped on. Nah, there's no water strip. This is. Do it by hand. If there's an auto strip, they'll be dead in line. And they'll stay that way. You do this because that bobcat does my new adjustments. Well, the others don't do that. No, is it perfectly straight and all that? No, you thought the strip. Do that. It's a way forward. You know what I mean? Doing your yard, when a delivery comes in, well, this is our farm brown rolls. Well, don't get me wrong. The bull cat there. Right, the John Deere you see in the corner is lovely. And I am a John Deere fan. But if I had a choice between John Deere and Bobcat, well, let's just say the John Deere would lose. If you don't want them to, then put it off centre. I try my hardest is to get rid of them two without getting rid of these four. You know. So, there you go. And you can basically use this for your silage. You can move your silage or bales or anything like that in there. Quite easily. Mm -hmm. Pretty much you can.
There you go. That's that for now. Now, you know, so we've got another one in here. And I'm going to open these doors. And this one's got a bucket on. The same mod. I'm going to show you what it's like to clean the cows out. There's a little bit of doo doo in there. So we're going to whip it out. Right, it's all because we've got these battles in, but as a rule, you can pretty much make the battles out. No. And we can play with the cows. <laughs> and then literally would just come out see what I mean it's a tight yard so this bobcat really does come into its own when we're doing stuff like this you know well I love it so much and there's your first bit of done. Jubbly jubbly. And this gives me a perfect opportunity to show off the other mod that I'm wearing. Oh, uh, it's not going to call it mod, but it is a mod, I suppose. This map is lovely. I'm sorry. For all you modders out there will think you've got good maps. Right, look at the experts. Right, what's the experts roll out a map? Now, well, right, okay, you could say you don't often roll out maps. No, maybe so. But when he does, they're maps. I mean, they're maps to be reckoned with. You know? I mean, I'd rather him bring out one hell of a map every 10 years and bring out 5 million maps that don't work properly you know? now I can sp guarantee probably this bobcat will go into 19 quite easily Cause look, look at the last one that went into about three different <laughs> games, didn't it? So now I'm watching the time because you know we don't want to be doing half hour, two hour, next, you know, on one mod. But this mod, people have obviously wanted for a long, long time, a long, long time. I know I have. You know, well, I think it's done well. I mean, I'm going to be taking some serious time over this. And I'm going to promote this as much as I can. And this is going to be in every, probably, well, nearly every episode of my uh, Let's Play. Because, of course, I've got the cow yard. And the cows are the main thing for this map. What we'd log in. Well, I'm afraid this is going to be in with the logins, it's going to be in with the cows, it's going to be in with everything. You know? Now I'm just putting it out there how nice this is. Okay? This is lovely. 
It's just so. What's the word? You know, like it's touching there, touching there. It wouldn't go. It wouldn't want to skip through. Stop. No. I find this lovely. So there we go. Now, let's get out of this yard. Now, what we're we gonna do? I mean, this is yellow. Before this was nice. I loved it. So low. Here it is. Right, let's go back to this. Oh no, I've got to show you something else quickly first. Let me go. Go. Go to the shop. Now. Don't want that. Well, we can go through that way, I suppose. Okay. I don't know that. I do want that one on that one. There we go. So, you know, this is what we had before. You know, it's alright. What we're used to, isn't it? But then it comes into its own game. And with that, and then that, but now we've got this, and this is what we want, you know. This is the sort of stuff that we've been waiting for for a long time. Now, without being greedy, we need to have some attachments because, watch. Right, I'm going to. It's fine. Now we've got the wheels. I think we'll probably get away with it this stuff right now. No, we don't. See, there's a problem already. Don't go and we've got JCB. That one with JCB? No, not at all. But we don't want to be seen on a bobcat. Okay. I don't want to be saying this on a bobcat. But we've got no option. No, we have lights. Bat lights, bright bat lights. No. She's lovely. You don't realise how much we wait for her to come along. So I'm so sorry for nearly a half an effort mod if you're on a bulk cat. And someone's probably spent six, seven months doing it. Sure. And we just spend 26 minutes or 28 minutes, you know, is nothing. So, this is Farm Brown down the phone with an other mod review on a fantastic map. And both of these are on Mod Hoster. So, just type in and you will see. Thank you ever so much. Will it, Bill? I'm bringing it ever so much. The model for this. Lovely. Speak to you later.